Today I'm playing a game in a series that I love but have only played like one game in it and there are many to choose from. This one's on the PlayStation and I think I'm in for a doozy. What is this? I, what is this gaming experience? I, I've never seen this. You gotta love that sound. You gotta love it. Welcome everybody to another first play. And uh, today we're gonna be playing a game that is submitted by one of our directors that will be joining us on our upcoming episode. His name is Siegfried. And we're gonna be playing the game they submitted which is called Legend of Mana. We have played games in this series before and we like them. Uh, Saiken Nintetsu 3 it was a standout for all three of us on the show. And this is one that was on the PlayStation 1. I thought it was Secret of Mana when Dustin revealed it, but that's not the case. It's Legend of Mana, which came out after, on the PlayStation. He said it's an action RPG. This is Square, 1999, 2000, yes please. Select your character. Okay, we have a boy and a girl. I'm going to be boy. Okay. Whoa, I already like this. I love sprite work on weapons, and I like the font we're using here. Very fantasy. Knife, sword, axe, two-handed sword. Ooh, two-handed axe, hammer, and spiel, spiel. We have builds? Like, builds for Dark Souls? I mean, typically, I go for, like, two-handed swords if I out of this option. Whoa, there's more! Scroll down, Nolan, and you'll see staff glove and look at the animation or the the stance changing whoa oh no this is a very difficult decision for me right now i will i part of me wants to look up a guide later and follow it and i'll probably tell me like a recommendation Oh my gosh, ah, the staff looks so cool. I'm going to go two-handed sword. I'm going to go two-handed sword. Okay. Uh, you... Is... Wait. Auto? Okay. Oh, that generates a, a fake name. Is the default name you? Why oh you? Why do they do this crap to us? Just give me the character's name. Donatoth? Danatoth? Heath? Elliot? Hawk? Okay, there aren't that many. I am going to press this four more times, and the name that shows up on the fourth one is our name. One, two, three, four. Julius Caesar. Select play area. Darkened areas cannot be chosen? Huh? It's t okay. Usually, usually RPGs tell you where you're gonna start and you deal with it. This is allowing me to start anywhere on the map. I have no idea, bro. I don't know. How about how about generally in this middle area? It's probably the recommended starting area, if there even is one. More selecting to do. What am I seeing? Place the mailbox on the map. Select a spot with the directional button and press X. You may place the mailbox on the brightly colored areas. What is the mailbox doing here? Sure. Salamander? Okay, so already, I'll just say I know nothing about the game. The replayability is through the roof. No? Because you can choose all these other things. Like... It's like choose your own adventure RPG on the PlayStation or something. My song. There are lyrics. Oh my gosh, there are lyrics. A lot of clouds or someone is smoking. What are those? Looks great. The like, you know, the pre-rendered back backgrounds and then the characters on the front, very like staple square graphic choice back then. A lot of smoke. Alright, is Gandalf present? 
Is Gandalf on the premises? Why is everything a smoke? Nice song, nice intro. I must get. <laughs> I don't have a lot of time. Okay, another great track I can already tell. Nine centuries ago, the mana tree burned to ashes. The power of mana lived on inside mana stones. Enchanted instruments and artifacts, they just fought with each other for control of these last remnants of mana. I was worried it was going to take that away from me. Remember me. Need me. I can provide you with everything. Is this the tree talking? I am love. Find me and walk beside me. This sounds familiar. All right, so we've got a Deku tree that is a little salty at people for not worshiping it anymore. Uh, interesting. Okay, nice little character design there. Square, nothing. X, nothing. Circles, run. There we go. That's a nice. That's a nice run. Pretty. Pretty quick. Great artwork there on Julius. Um, level one. We got some skills, maybe. Oh, yeah, okay. Power, HP, spirit, skill, defense, charm, luck, magic. Yes! I like stats. And we have an even spread so far. We have Menos two handed sword. Power level of equipped weapon is off. And it's, well, maybe that's a skill or something. Uh, d -d 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 you have stats based on the equipment you get. Okay. Triangle is jump. Circle is defend. Okay, some of that's going to come into play, I'm sure. Wow, menu. That's an ocarina. Whoa. Instrument? This is like a file explorer. Instruments go into stat and then... Stat? Whoa. Status of instruments, equipments, elemental attributes, artifacts, diary. Whoa, dude. I'm very impressed by these graphics as well. This looks like a children's storybook, like in a good way. You know what I mean? Like it's it, it's like hand drawn and sh and it looks amazing. It looks amazing on the PlayStation 1. Hey, let's go. Let's exit to world map actually and see maybe there's a another place for us to go sure enough uh press square to select an artifact okay color blocks was the artifact i was given okay and we have a little turn wheel here choose color blocks place that on the map whoa what is this what is this gaming experience? I, I've never seen this. Wow, it is literally like a pop-up book. Domina. Gnome. What's that in the top corner? Gnome. Okay. Another freaking map? This is a map sim. But the highway is full of bandits. It's too dangerous to leave the town. Don't you think so? No. How brave of you. I can't do business with those highwaymen about. Let's go teach those bandits a lesson. Once we're done, I'll make you rich. Yes. Say goodbye to that one. Yes. Oh, I can't take my party member? What? I like people who know the value of money. Nicolo's business unusual? Okay, maybe a quest? Maybe I started a quest? I still need to stop and see Tipo come with me. Where? Oh my, you're in my party now? What is going on? You got wheel AF. What? Okay, look. Uh, I know what to do with this. I think I need to go back to the, the world world map. Uh, artifact. Yeah, it is. Okay, placing it right here. Dude, you really are building a, um, it's almost like a board game, kind of. Like, you're building a path of the game you want to play, which to me is extremely interesting, but so far, very confusing. Luan Highway. The maps on maps is... Okay, first bat. Whoa, 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 whoa. Free, free four? Wait a minute. Square? Okay, triangle is that jump I saw earlier. 
Oh, it's, it's not turn-based, guys. It's a uh, real-time action. It is an action RPG. This is an action RPG. Like a real one. The bone explosion is crazy. Wow, and they have drops. Whoa. The, okay, the little crystals are XP. And, and obviously the money. Music's insane, dude. It's... What else can we do? Uh, circle is block? X is also an attack. What do the triggers do? Nothing yet. Okay. Whoa! Bunny going off! Giant swing. Jump candy. A lot going on, guys. Sorry. A lot going on. What? I don't know what to think. I don't know what to think right now. That is so impressive to me at how different of a game we're dealing with this week. Way It blew away my expectations. I really thought I was going to get thrown into a cookie cutter RPG where it tells you exactly what to do. Instead, I got one that lets me pick my main character, Warrior, Warrior Girl, I get to pick from a list of like 10 main weapons. I get to choose my party members on the fly and which quests I want to do. I get to choose which part of the map I want to begin my journey. I then get to place the different towns that are adjacent to each other to travel to. And I have free control in battle to freestyle. And the menu is just expansive and there's depth. I really and truly am overwhelmed. A lot of games don't do this to me. I'm truly overwhelmed, but in a good way. I'm definitely going to use a guide this week because I need a little assistance here. Um, just to, to know what exactly, not optimal, just maybe recommended, maybe maybe something that's good to do. Whew, we're going to have all three have different playthroughs. Wow. Find a copy of Legend of Mana. Play along with us this week and join us on our upcoming director episode with Siegfried. I'll see you then.